Hello everyone! We will be creating our own Ethereum ERC20 token in this video. So first, we need to download MetaMask, which will be our Ethereum uh, wallet. So from the link I provided below, go there and click Add to Chrome. So here, and then we add it as extension of our Chrome. So this is needed. This is needed so we can store the token that we will be creating on this wallet. So click on continue and type your password. I will be using um, green goblin 88 this password. And then you need to accept the terms of use and copy this ones for the backup phase so we can still uh, access the wallet later. And using the one that you copied, put them back. Nurse during tomato decide to elite curb peanut news manual skin and miss and then confirm now we can actually directly deposit ether here or we can buy coinbase or deposit with shift sheet so these are the different uh different functionalities that you can have on MetaMask and you can copy this one. This one is actually your Ethereum address but we will not be dealing much about those. Now that we have our own uh, wallet provider, the MetaMask, you can actually access it from here. So you can see here that I have my account with this address and currently I have no Ethereum. So this is the main network we can go on to Rapston network. This is a test network, so we don't have to actually uh, use real money in creating our token for this tutorial. So go on to Rapston test network and get some ether from Faucet. So from here, you can get your uh, free ether from here and then connect. There is some error. Let's try another website for the Rapsten network. Make sure that you are uh, make sure that you are using the same network for the Ethereum that you will be using. Like this one is Rapsten, so we will be using the Rapsten Ethereum faucet as well. So send me test Ether. So we need some Ethereum to create our uh, token. So now that we have seen that test Ether has been sent to this address, we can see it from here. So now we have our one Ethereum on our uh, Rubston test network. Okay, now that we have our wallet where we will be storing our token and Ethereum to create our uh, token, now go on to this side so we can create our own token so it is the token factory website note that there are different ways to actually create your own token you can actually write your own solidity but uh your own solidity contract but you will get the same result if you choose this one and it will save you time and uh it will cause you less error in creating your own uh, token. Okay, so from here you can see that there are different uh, functionalities that you can use. We will be using create token contract. So the important things that you have to put into here would be the total supply, the name, the number of decimals, and symbol. So Let's say that I will have 
my own token name i will call it goblin uh, gold goblin coin with a token symbol of gld and total supply of uh, let's say 15 million Mm. and decimal places of 18. Note that you can use decimal places from 0 to 18 but most tokens use 18 decimals and it will be easier to follow that when, especially when you are uh, creating the contract because uh, the calculation will be different for sending or integrating it with other coins later so uh, take note also that if the total supply that you want is 15 you have to add the number of 18 decimals so that means that we have the 15 million here so that's one two three one two three and then we add 18 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. So that's 18 zeros. That stands for the decimal places. Okay, let's count again. That's like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. Okay, we add it to the 15 million earlier let's copy this and put it as our total supply and then let's put our name here that token name and the token symbol here and number of decimal places 18 note that i always want to have a notepad on this side so i can easily just copy and paste and i don't put any incorrect information on the site so now that we are all ready let's click on create token and we will get the metamask notification so you can see that i am deploying it on robston network which is our test network and this one has a gas fee of 0 0.02 to ether that's why we needed our ether earlier and the amount of gas fee would be like around two dollars now that we are okay with this one you can also like uh check on the data like where's the origin you can see it here and then just click on confirm so now we are creating our token and just waiting for a confirmation let's wait for a while while it's creating the uh, contract our token contract so it's still pending let's wait for a while sometimes it takes some time depending on the network whether it's PC or not okay so now that we have the result it says that our contract has been deployed it's confirmed and we have our eth deducted for the gas fee and we have our goblin gold coin as our uh name and gld for the symbol you can actually send it to another ethereum address on Robson network using the same wallet so now that we have deployed it go on and we cannot see our tokens here yet so we will go and click on add token since this is a custom token that we have made go on to add token custom token and contract address so contract address is the erc contract of the one that we created you can check it here so this is our uh, token contract 
address. So you can actually see here that you're interacting with token address at this one. So let's paste it here and back to our MetaMask. Let's do it again, add token, custom token, our contract address here with that, and you can see that it automatically uh, added the token symbol of GLD, this one, and decimals of 18. Now we click on next and we add it. And here you can see I have the 15 million GLD token that we have just created using Token Factory. You can send it to other people using MetaMask as well. You can input here their address and the amount that you want. When you input here the amount, if you want to send 1,000, you just put on 1,000 without the decimal place holder anymore and then just click on next. Okay, so that's it for our tutorial. Uh, let me know if it is helpful and you can actually add it on your uh, Ethereum address as well and I can send you free ones <laughs> for your testing. Okay, so that's it. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you. Bye.